not sure what we're going to get here. Something uh, unusual. <laughs> Good grief. The bottom line is oh, for Chow yeah. Yupeng, yeah. who's won the session 5 4. Mark, Mark Allen finished the better of the two players. <laughs> well, if someone could take a picture of Yamba Hass now, hole in the ice bucket. That's why they call him the ice man. There you see. Come on. Dying off. <laughs> oh, that's not obvious. <laughs> He's only joking, Steve. <laughs> Steve Davis. Come on, he's saying, reeling it in. Anyone else would treat it as a very unsporting, <laughs> but he didn't mean it. Dave's a good guy, takes it in good part. Five. Played it the brave way. Eleven. Well, what? Kao Yu Peng, seven, frame, and the match. to lose. I think it is. Follow <laughs> 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 <Well, laughs> miss. Can we have a look at that again? <laughs> Impossible. Let's have another look. Wow. That's amazing, isn't it? I bet you can't do it again. This time, Moira, he's got to mass it up more. He's got to be hitting down on the cue ball. Oh, what has he done here? Oh, hold on, hold on. This is what. This is one way to hit the brown. What a shot this is! <laughs> <laughs> oh, John Virg. I think he just caught, caught his leg. It is. I'm not sure whether he caught it on the on the table, but uh, he's almost been given a dead leg. Oh! Hi, hi, hi! Where's the cue ball going? Oh, oh, have you so ever so seen so anything so like that in your life? The most amazing shot I think in the history of snooker has just been played. Never seen anything like it in my life. Look at the red. Look at the backspin on the red. What happened there? And then look at the cue ball catches a jaw in the middle pocket, hugs the cushion, goes in off. Never seen anything like that, ever. And he's made the screw back, and is he going to finish behind yellow and brown? Well, would you believe it? Let's cast our mind back to three shots ago. Even Ali can see the funny side of it. <laughs> we can give him a round of applause. I don't think he means that one. I don't think he means that one, but in all fairness, Judd... <laughs> this is tricky. Can he reach it? Does he need the spider? He wants to play it. <laughs> well, you can reach it like that. <laughs> nice one. Yeah, that's right. Clean up after your mess. Oh, hang on. Steady, Rob. Steady. That, no, quick, no. quick. You got it. <laughs> well, everyone's excited Thank to be you. back at the snooker, clearly. <laughs> and disaster was averted there. This blue may not stay on Things the table. better watch out here. <laughs> yeah. Shout four.
stop it now. <laughs> go in. He needs another unbelievable shot. Hello, is it going to go in? Oh, nearly, nearly. That would have been a legal shot if it had dropped in. He could actually get through to it directly. I thought he had to swerve it, but he could get through directly. And if that had dropped in that corner pocket... I was definitely going to drop in the pocket. We actually, last week, we almost double-kissed it in as well. It's not going in, is it? It can't be going in. Oh my goodness. I think from that reaction, good. Mark thinks he's had a bad run of the balls in this match. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. Um... Right, guys, it's the gents' side. You're both on the wrong side. Sorry, are we? You're both on the wrong side. Well, the referee. <laughs> He's telling him, uh, excuse me, guys, you're in the wrong seat. I don't know whether that would uh, affect the scoreboard any, you know. Imagine making a hundred break and they give it to the other man. <laughs> Is this your bottle? Yeah, that's my glass. Uh, that's, that's your glass. Yeah. Yeah, Tommy Cooper would do a routine here, wouldn't he? Glass bottle. Karen Wilson, 10. And the frame. 